to or welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long time. I filmed an intro for this video, but I didn't really film much after that, so I'm thinking of just restarting basically. Um my hair is just so dry, so I'm gonna do a little sun sun with it. But um how have you guys been? A little bit of a life update, but I'm sure you guys already know from the title of this video. Um, I just spent my first night in my apartment. Uh, technically, I don't know if this counts as moving out, like, because I didn't really want to count moving out for, um, moving out into my dorm last September because I just felt like that doesn't really count. Most people go home after that or they just come back and do more temporary housing. But after my dorm, I moved out of my dorm two weeks ago and this week my lease for my apartment started. I'm also staying in Kingston for the whole summer, so that basically means that like, my life is basically Kingston now. Kingston is now my hometown, like, not hometown, but like, it's now where I reside, and I have no problem with that. Like, I know a lot of people fight it, like, oh, I don't claim Kingston, da 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 da. I'm fine. I came here to go to do my undergrad and hopefully do my med school here. I'm fine here. Like, I'm okay. Okay, so first fit check in the new place. Um, I'm keeping it casual today, like, so because there wasn't really any space for me in the um in the kitchen i had to put a lot of my things on like the top top shelf i was able to put all my pots and pans under the sink um which i had to clean i think something had spilled down there and so nobody wanted it so it was the only thing that was empty so i cleaned it put my pots and pans and bigger items down there um and then i was able to put like my toaster my I guess kitchenware and then my actual food like up high uh and yeah, so because of that, I had to take the very top shelves, me and my 5'1 self. Um, so I'm really okay. I had this from the time I moved into my dorm. Like, I just always knew, like, yeah, girl, just get yourself a little, a little step stool. you know cleaning up the kitchen doing my dishes and eating um i definitely undercooked the oats i'm gonna see if i can get some like cute organization things for my desk i mean i already have like one major organization thing here but um not so much for my desk but i have a lot of my food stuff in here like i said i won't be getting the other storage space for a while so if i can find anything that could go like underneath my desk that has like drawers and stuff so the food things can actually go away right now they're just in a big huge pile and i don't even know what i have i mean it's not important for me right now just because like i don't really have anything to do with my days but when i move here next time um i'll literally be starting working less than 12 hours like i'm coming here to sleep literally and then get ready for work in the morning so yeah hopefully i'll find some of that stuff i need to find my wallet it was in the pants i wore yesterday and i don't know where to put them like super dark over here i bought a little i well first of all i already knew my window would be small i'll show you guys what my window looks like in a second but it's super small and on top of that it's like walks into like a small nook in the room so there's literally like small window and then wall wall 
before my actual room starts so it just like closes everything in even more because i feel like a window that small but if it was like just like a four walled room like it would still light up the room anyways i bought a little lamp it's from ikea so the box was saying that it included one light bulb but no it excluded one light bulb so i'm lightless it's a good thing i did this before like moving here before work because i would have to deal with this and like be ordering a whole bunch of stuff from online um yeah hey guys so i just did a little bit more organizing i feel like nothing is exactly going away because every time i find a spot for something i had temporarily placed something else there so every time i put something away i end up pulling something out <sighs> and just the kitchen stuff being in my room is like really stopping me from like you know and then the lack of organization like i'm seeing a lot of stuff whereas like these were all here before they were just in drawers tucked away so i wasn't seeing them so it's just making me feel like Everything's unorganized, but it's moving along. Alana just got here, so I'm gonna go over there. Um, she's not really moving anything in for real because she's not living here for the summer. She literally just like brought all her boxes from her dorm back. Um, so that's all that. But yeah, I'm gonna go over there. She brought cake, so I'm gonna go eat cake. So I just ate like the leftovers from, I need to get used to turning off the bathroom light at my dorm last year. It was like an automatic, so yeah. Um, I just finished eating the leftovers from yesterday and Elena left the cake to me. So I'm going to have a little bit of that. The apartment's actually really dirty. I'm going to whisper because I didn't, I don't want anyone to hear me, but like obviously I don't think it's their fault. Because me and one of the other girls just moved in and then so it's only one girl who was like originally living here and I say I don't blame her like that's like a lot to clean by yourself so I am going to try and clean I'm so greasy I'm going to try and clean like the microwave the oven a whole bunch of stuff uh tonight just have a few errands to do today and then i'm going back home for a week just so i can celebrate my nephew's birthday with my family and then i have a few like doctor's appointments like eye doctor appointment and whatnot just to get done before i come up here for the summer yeah last night i booked view rail tickets i was gonna do pop ride but i don't know other people always get cheaper pop rides but mine were like starting at around forty dollars and then the one that I was getting rejected because it's last minute, I guess. I should have booked this like earlier, but yeah, I kept getting rejected by a few drivers and then one driver that requested him. He hasn't gone back to me yet, but his um, his rides are like 70 something dollars. So I just booked the V-Rail, which was also $72. Like, I have to meet with my employer just for like a debrief. So I have a little bit of paperwork to fill out before I go. And then I just pick up my outfit, it's on my bed. I'm making coffee right now. I'm just going to have an apple and banana. I'm not going to do the whole oatmeal thing just because I don't feel like doing dishes. And when I come back, I need to find something to eat too. So I'm probably going to cook again. So let me just have something light for now. <laughs> guys 
so I just got back from meeting like a few people at the office, signing some papers, and yeah, I'm super excited to start next Monday. Um, I think it's gonna be fun. Everybody I met was super nice, and the office is super nice. So yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here because after this, I'm just gonna eat, pack my stuff up, and then go catch my train. But yeah, see you guys in the next one. Bye.